In this episode, we'll show a retrofit wall install of Looseville from inside the home and from outside. First, we'll show how the wall hose attachment connects to the coupler. Next, we'll demo the interior preparation. Then we'll demo the exterior preparation. Finally, we'll demo inserting the wall hose attachment into the cavity and filling a cavity. To connect the wall hose attachment to the adapter, Insert the hose coupler into the wall hose attachment and slide the locking collar toward the hose coupler. To remove the attachment, slide the locking collar away from the hose coupler and remove the wall hose attachment. The colored rings in the wall hose attachment show how far into the cavity to insert the wall hose to pass electrical wiring. The black mark closest to the operator indicates proper depth for a 10-foot cavity. The red mark indicates depth for a 9-foot cavity and the blue mark indicates depth for an 8-foot cavity. Use a stud finder to mark both sides of the stud. Pay attention to hazards in the wall such as nails, screws, and electrical wires. Then mark roughly the center of the cavity from the stud, here being 7 to 8 inches from the stud edge. Here you'll drill out a 3-inch hole to insert the wall hose. Once your location is marked, drill out the hole. To remove the siding, firmly insert the siding tool into the seam. A loud pop will indicate the tool is fully inserted. Run the tool the length of the siding to unzip the seam. Next, pull the nails from the course of siding you intend to remove. Firmly pull the siding down and away from the house. Repeat the stud finding process from earlier, marking the stud. Avoid electrical wiring and other hazards. Mark the drilling location and proceed to drill. To select wall mode on your ProCap machine, press the button indicating wall mode. To view the preset density modes, press the button indicating menu. To change the density to another setting, press the button indicating select. To fine tune the currently selected density, press the button indicating adjustment. Then press the same button, now indicating density. Here you can increase or decrease to preset density using the plus or minus buttons. Pressing the back button automatically saves your settings. Insert the wall hose attachment toward the bottom of the cavity through the three inch hole you've just drilled. Continue to insert the hose to the proper depth marker. Once you've achieved the proper depth, Turn on the ProCap machine in wall mode and fill the bottom of the cavity. The ProCap machine has an internal density sensor. Once density has been met, insulation will stop flowing and the machine will grow louder. Withdraw the hose and insert it toward the top of the cavity. Proceed to fill the cavity until insulation stops flowing. Withdraw the hose slowly, stopping at every depth marker. Insulation will continue to flow. Once the insulation stops flowing again, proceed to the next depth marker. This will ensure density is met. To finish the wall, use an exterior wood plug or drywall patching kit to seal the cavity. Find out more at owenscorning.com forward slash ProCat.